Good morning, STM. This is a message from your prefects. As you all know this land, we are promoting kindness in our school community. So your Lentless Kindness Challenge for the day is to ask someone how their day is going or has been. Remember to show love out there. That's all from your prefects. Thanks, STM. This capsule is presented by Canadian Heritage. This statue depicts a scene from Canadian history. Until 1929, women were not considered persons under Canadian law. Here, five exceptional Canadian women who led the fight for legal recognition as persons have just learned that they'd won. Section 24 of the British North America Act prohibited women from becoming senators because they weren't considered to be properly qualified persons. The famous five, Emily Murphy, Irene Parlby, Louise McKinney, Henrietta Muir Edwards and Nellie McClung fought to have the law changed. The case ended up before the Supreme Court. The court ruled against the women, but the Privy Council overturned the decision several months later, a milestone in the history of human rights in Canada. In 2009, the Senate named them as Canada's first honorary senators. This artwork, unveiled in 2000, is the first monument on Parliament Hill to commemorate Canadian women. The artist, Barbara Patterson, chose to portray the women as average folk, wearing plain period dress and placing them on the ground rather than on pedestals as with most other national politicians and monarchs. Marking that they were ordinary women but with extraordinary strength, the sculpture setup invites visitors to mingle with them as they are toasting their renowned victory over a cup of tea. An identical monument stands in Alberta, the province where all five women lived at the time. Good morning, STM. My name is Josh. And my name is Nehruz, and, and we are announcements for today. Attention to all students who are interested in writing the upcoming Waterloo Math Contest. The Uslid Contest for Grade 12 is on April 3rd during periods 1 and 2. To register for this contest, you must submit a, two, a $20 deposit. The Friar Galois Hepatia contest for grades 9 to 11 is on April 4th during periods 1 and 2. To register for this contest, you must submit a $15 deposit. All deposits can be submitted to Ms. Shirelli Char in room 350 during periods 2 and 4. The last day to register for both contests is today. A reminder to all members of more debate of our meeting today after school in the library for our first research debate. Hope to see you all there. Reminder to all senior badminton players that there is a practice tonight at 2.45 to 4.15. Thanks from your coaches. A reminder for junior boys trying out for soccer that Thursday's tryout has been canceled. We will continue tryouts after the March break. Listen to announcement for updates. This is a reminder to the senior, junior, to the senior, junior, and novice boys basketball team to please hand in their permission forms for the Raptors 905 game as soon as possible to teacher coaches. The game is on Thursday with a departure time from the cafeteria at 6 p.m. There is an important meeting for all Knights Fighting Cancer members after school in room 151. We are planning upcoming events such as the Relay for Life in May and Cancer Awareness Month in April. Stay tuned, STM. Attention all HOSC club members. There will be a meeting after school today in room 333. One, and learn about the heart. And build a clay model with new members. New members are always welcome. See you, see Miss Newberry for more details. Lunch Lunch is brought back STM. Come out to room 221 to play board games, have snacks, and hang out. Brought to you by your prefect STM. This is a reminder there will be a new student breakfast today during period 2 in room 250. That's all your announcements for today. Thanks STM. Good morning STM students. I'm Rachel here for your student council announcement. A reminder that the acceptable spirit wear is available to pick up at the Student Council office during your third, third and fourth period lunches. Also, if you are considering to run for Student Council President, the election forms are due on March 20th. Be sure to check out your LMS for the nomination forms. Grade 11s and 12s, promise tomorrow. We are excited to see you at Carmen's Event Center at 6 p.m. 
A reminder, if you want to be nominated for a prom award, be sure to DM student council before prom or before 7 p.m. The list of prom awards can be found on the student council's Instagram. That's all STM. Don't forget to follow us at STM underscore council for everything council related. Thanks, STM. Well, STM, those are all of your announcements for today. The time is now 8.20, and remember, it's a great day to be a knight.